and ASU students on edge before classes even started. Campus police say two female students were groped today on campus and tonight the suspect is still at large. Team 12's Bianca Bono is live in Tempe and Bianca students have to be really worried about this. What are they saying? Yeah, Mark Caribe school hasn't even started yet. These troubling reports coming out as parents are moving their kids in. So now some students we talked to say this school year they're going to be more alert. It's not how ASU students expected to start a new school year. You never really think it's going to happen to you until you get these alerts. On the morning of move in day, police sending out a campus wide alert. Two female students were groped. It's really scary because when I'm doing experiment, I have to go to school at 5.30 a.m. According to ASU police, the incident's happening in broad daylight just after 10 Friday morning. The first at a parking structure on Rural Road and less than 30 minutes later, the second at a parking structure a block away on McAllister Avenue. Police believe the same man is responsible and both students telling police the man touched them inappropriately. In one case, the suspect reaching under the student's skirt. We weren't too shocked like when we heard it, which we should be. Um, so it is kind of sad and concerning. According to crime statistics linked on ASU's website, in the past six months, there have been more than 1,800 assaults reported in Tempe. Now, as a new school year is set to begin, Campus police using these disturbing incidents to remind students to stay vigilant. And if you see something, say something. In this day and age, we're often going like this. You need to remember just to stay alert. And throughout ASU's campuses, students can look for those blue emergency boxes, which will connect them directly to ASU police. As for the suspect, police say it's a man 30 to 40 years old, and he does have long brown hair. We're live in Tempe tonight. Bianca Bono, 12 News at 10. Okay.